So, I was sitting down wasting my life away watching videos until I came across this video. Some random with 60k kills wanted a 1v1. So the queen gotta put him back. After watching the silliness, I have decided to react to other content in the strongest battlegrounds video sphere. Let's get into it. Oh my god. I hate the new strongest battlegrounds. I miss the old Saitama battlegrounds. I can't take it anymore I miss- Let's go Saitama Battlegrounds. I love this game Saitama Battlegrounds. Let's go. Oh, 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 oh. I hate it when I see these types of videos. I've seen a few of these now and I say the same thing every single time. There is literally no difference from before and after. This is a video that you release in like two years when the developers start to stop caring about their game and it becomes pay to win. Or something along those lines. What avatar you wear in the strongest battleground says about you. These are my opinions and I'm Mel. You like to kill people with style and without flaw. You smell like canned tuna and beans. And you probably think using soap over body wash is more hygienic. Go outside and smell the sun air. You're exactly like the anime tryhards. Except you're not good at the f game. Hold on. I'd just like to intervene real quick and ask. Why is blood so mad? You had to have been destroyed by these guys. The characters are way too specific. Also in my experience, these guys are your average 4000 kill fighters, not really that good. People like you make me sick inside. You make me feel like the world is burning to a helling crisp as you poison this community with how weird you act. Please in all the holy matter, leave. I really couldn't care about you worthless worms. Your dad should have pulled it out. Whoa. I. Let's just go on to the next one. Alright, so this guy tried to predict the next character after Sonic. Let's see if he was right. Yo, what's good with y'all boys, man? In this video, I'm going to be explaining the character that is most likely going to be added right after Sonic in Roblox, the strongest battlegrounds. Yeah. So let's get right into the video. Now, the reason why I believe that Metal Bat is going to be the next character that five minutes later. Specifically, if you take a look in the emotes and sticker section on the Discord server, one hour later. It's Saitama. <laughs> this next character is Garu. <laughs> this next character is Gojo. <laughs> and this next character is it's Genos. Thank you for telling me that. Otherwise, I would not have known that those were the characters. Seriously though, this short has gone on for a whole minute and I still have yet to know who the new character could be. I'm just gonna save myself the time and see if he was right. If you take a look on the screen, this is the character that they added on the Discord. However, this character has not been added in the game. And he was correct. I just wish he could have told me it sooner. Using Atomic Samurai as the world's best player. Not the cap. Public servers be so easy. <laughs> Who are you? I've never seen this person in all my time playing this game. I checked the all-time leaderboard and you're not there. I also checked seasonal leaderboard and still not there. The world's best player is a stretch I'd say. Maybe the world's best pub stomper though. Ah, it's gonna be now! Huh? It's gonna be now! Okay, I'm sorry I put you through that. Now, there is a lot to unpack here so let's get to it. First of all, what is this godforsaken audio? You know what, forget that I don't even want to know. Secondly, I understand some people are in a worse off situation than me, but the fact that the graphics are this low makes it look like you're playing on a 4x4 Minecraft world. Third of all, what is this Susia exploit? All of these things combined makes me want to get the hell out of here. Okay, so I stumbled across this strongest battlegrounds YouTuber called Mangopool, and he has some very interesting videos to say the least. Only in Ohio, Sigma Let's watch a few of his videos. Boros is my Roblox girlfriend now. Okay, already in the first three seconds, so much just happened, but I'm just gonna let the video play. Oh my gosh, do you guys see that? Boros the e-girl? Yo, I didn't Level know Boros gas. was big like that. Guys, I kind of want to walk up to her, but like, I, I'm really nervous. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna use ChatGPT to help me come up with some pickup lines. I just had to give me some pickup lines for an e-girl named Boros. Bro, these pickup lines are so good. Okay, guys, I'm gonna walk up to her and use one of my pickup lines. That Boros is unbelievably f No, wait, hold up. There is so much wrong with this video. This might be the weirdest video I've ever seen. Like why is Boros a girl? And why are you rizzing it up? There's no way this video could get any worse. I must have used my ultimate move because I can't resist your gravity. Bro, Boros should said L Riz. You know what guys? I never wanted to do this, but I don't know how to live my life from here on out. Boros doesn't want to be my Roblox girlfriend. Honestly guys. No Mangapool, it is not your time to die yet. 
This is not the first time that Mr. Mangapool has messed around with One Punch Man E-Girls. I'm gonna turn Gojo, Boros, Metal Bat, Atomic Samurai, and Golden Arrow into E-Girls, and I need you guys to rate which one is the best. Hmm. So it seems that nobody is safe from being turned into an E-Girl. Why does Golden Arrow have to be turned into an E-Girl too? They aren't even part of any real animes. There's something deeper here. There's something that we all as a collective viewer are missing. Why does this man Mango Pool keep turning people into goddamn e girls? This is the e girl version of Boros. <laughs> this is the e girl version of Gojo. <laughs> this is the e girl version of Metal Bat. <laughs> this is the. E nope. That's it, I can't take it anymore. Before we end off this video, I want to tell you guys that I have opened my own Discord server. Join to be in future videos, connect with me and other DCI members, and see sneak peeks of my future videos. Goodbye.